Greetings YouTube, Kunis here, and let's continue our Sudanese expedition. Where we last left off, the Ottomans pulled off pulled us into another Mamluk war, so we're gonna let them do that. We're gonna pretend it doesn't exist, and we're gonna try to continue fixing our economy in the background. Not that it's working very well right now with our armies being at full maintenance and our forts being activated and everything, but uh, we do what we can, and the Ottomans are currently stomping them really hard anyway. Has Cyprus been diplovassalized? Cyprus has been diplovassalized. Cute. Um, Joman, Bagos spawned rebels. Do I have troops? I have troops nearby. And by nearby, I mean over there. That's fine. Uh, oh, is Jola finally able to kill his own rebels? Because that's interesting. Are you still allowed with, you're still allowed with Stronghai and Jenny, but not the other? Oh yeah, because I made you break that alliance by attacking you at the right time. Excellent. That is exactly what I was hoping for. Hey, I'm converting this? I'm apparently converting this. Amazing. I have so much foresight. Okay, um, now, am I telling uh, Joel off to fabricate some claims? Uh, I don't want to lose admin points, but I can totally... Uh, how close is it to being done? It's almost done. It's gonna take a bit longer, but let's just make it quarantined. It'll be fine. Let's kill these rebels. How about you stop attritioning yourself like a champion? Also, my poor money. Okay, so that's dead. That problem solved itself. Let's go back to Gold Coast. Because we need to uh, prepare Wida for colonization. And once that's done, we'll be able to look into eating Bene, who currently has no friends. And is currently getting killed by Noop and Dagbon. Which leads me to believe that Bene may be on his way out as a uh, power in this region, which is fine by me. He's also developed his capital quite a bit, and I'm very interested in the Niger estuary and the natural arbor it represents. The Ulema will give me a ton of ducats. This uh, gives me a little reprieve, but at the same time not really, because I'm going to spend it to keep building things. Oh look, natives. Act surprised. They're dead. How long until uh, that nation spawns here now? So how long until the Ottomans peace out the Mamluks? Because I would very much like to not be in this war anymore. Um, but at the same time, my vassal is doing the contribution for me, which is fine by me. The Ottomans currently owe me 10 favors, so let's uh, bump that up to 70. We're almost at 80. 80 being the most important point to reach in this quest for... Oh, France could even be bumped up to 55. Exciting. I need to get both of them to never betray me ever. And the only time that they would ever betray me is if they decided to war with each other, which as far as I know is not gonna happen. Because they're too far from each other. Ooh, Naples has seen better days. Naples is independent. Naples has uh, broken free from Castile somehow. And thus been consumed by the Pope. And now the Pope is having trouble with Neapolitan separatists who will spit Naples right back out. In an ironic twist of fate. My poor money is constantly shrinking. Do I have unrest? I have some unrest in a few provinces, but... Uh, what is causing it? I'm still slightly overextended. I'm almost done coring Constantine. That is bound to help. Yeah, overextension was part of it. Lots of separatism. That's about to decay itself into oblivion, which is amazing. Um... Dodeni and Azawad will not be a problem. I could bump up stability, but that would delay my economic ideas, which land maintenance modifier, very important right now. Um, I like the fort on Timbuktu for now, but I will destroy it eventually. I should fabricate a claim on Stronghai. He will be... Wait. He's no longer allied to Timbuktu. He broke his alliance with Timbuktu. He broke his alliance with Timbuktu. Also, I believe I was trying to tell my vassal earlier to get claiming. So get claiming, vassal. You have one job. Now, um, this colony is almost done. Yeah, Roman fever was a good call. Let's, uh, however, mothball the armies. And maybe mothball a fort somewhere. Like this one. Whoa, not destroyed, mothball. Okay. We have saved the economy. 
can also mod ball this one. It's worth. I can even destroy this one technically. Well, not until I've taken Ciuta at least, but uh, uh, no, it's useful for now. I will mod ball it though. Bent the social protests. Unfortunate. Bago has converted properly. We can finally get our nationalistic enthusiasm. And we got Defend the Coastline, which makes our galleys even better. Important when we want to keep raiding people. When can I raid again? How do I... Uh... Raided Coast expires in November 1508, so I will be able to begin raiding once again very soon. Let's get ready. That's exciting. There is so much money to be made. So much extortion to gain. Oh, yeah, Alexandria is mine. Good job, vassals. Uh, mission fulfilled. Imperial cities. Uh, I can decide which one will be the capital. Um, interesting. Because there have been several great cities, but... Uh, Fez is not a great capital, but at least it has the Renaissance right now. Marrakesh is also usually a good one. Meknes. Where the hell is Meknes? This matters. Um, Meknes is this one. Also a decent province. Also almost has the Renaissance. Does not have a fort though. And Rabat. Uh, where is Rabat? Where is Rabat indeed? Um... Hmm. I feel like I'm blind. I feel like it's right in front of me. And I hate feeling this way. Uh, Garon Fadukala Abda. No, it's not here. Where the hell is it? It's not one of these. Hmm. That's Tangiers. Okay, I give up. Where is Rabat? Oh, it's Garb. Yes. Damn it, event. You are misleading me, this province, which is actually a natural harbor and therefore can be developed, is only a dryland instead of um, mountains. Does it have the Renaissance at all? It does not, but it could. But right now it belongs to the merchants. Uh, I could take... Hmm... I think I'll just keep Fez. I think it makes sense, because Fez is not a bad province. Although Gar being coastal is interesting if I was to build a fort in it. Um, I dislike that Portugal has a claim, but Portugal has claims on a lot of my stuff. Um, how, um, how much do my estates like me? My Ulam are currently slightly unhappy. My merchants are pretty chill. They have a lot of power, and I could even give them more. And I think Garb will make sense more to develop colonialism in. So let's go with Rabat, actually. Yeah, we'll move the capital there. And the Renaissance will spread very slowly there. Unfortunately, it'll spread a lot faster once it finishes spreading into Meknes. But I'm just hoping I'll be able to embrace it soon, because this is... Uh, Getting really expensive to tech up. Oh wow, if I had 573 ducats, I could embrace the Renaissance. And it's about time to raid, I know what I'll be doing. Oh, November 1508. An exciting time for all. A time of great revenue for our nation. Also, this is almost done. But I did not prepare Wida for uh, my occupation of it. Let's unfortunately do this. 27 October, crap, that's too, that's too soon. Too soon. Okay, good, they didn't spawn. Let's kill them. With low morale, but it doesn't matter. Because we greatly out them. They are dead. As they should be. Remoth ball the army. Excellent. Rooting out corruption is expensive because of unbalanced research. A problem that will start being solved here. Profit efficiency plus 15%. Interesting, but not relevant. I can lose 10 prestige. That's not a problem. 
I can make states. Algiers is decent, I guess, but no. Um, okay, Mechanist will almost have it. Wait, we are in December. It is raid o'clock. It is time to raid ourselves a renaissance. Alright, there's 26 ducats. I can go all the way up to Acorunia. Gotta keep raiding those ghosts. Raid the ghosts of the infidel. 52 ducats from uh, the Portuguese mainland. Exciting. Here's another 60 ducats. The Gold Coast is self-sustaining, which means we can start colonizing wider. Um, let's go to Acorunia. I think Acorunia is too far, though. I think that was the thing. Yeah, it is too far from our homelands. All right. Cool. Let's go back down. We got some more stuff to raid. Especially now that Portugal converted this province. I will raid the crap out of it. That's what you get. Ooh, 53 ducats. Nice. We are buying ourselves a renaissance. Sweet. Gotta raid all the things. Raid. 69 ducats. There's this island, Mallorca. Uh, April 1519. Which we currently are. Hmm. It'll probably pop up, because uh, the other, I saw the button activate, so maybe it'll activate on its own. No? No? Oh, nine, wait, 1919, whoops, wrong date. I can raid some of this stuff. Gotta keep raiding. Can come and raid Savoy. Majestic, let's raid those trading cities. Delicious. Ooh, 96 ducats. I have an idea. I can get Global Empire. Fabricate claims in overseas colonial regions. Nice. Raid the Pope. 59 ducats. Portugal did a thing. I don't care. Raid the Sicily. I'm pretty sure I can almost uh, click the damn button for Renaissance. Raid that coast. See, we don't take loans. We take withdrawals from European coasts. Excellent. Renaissance, finally. Finally. And there's still some more things that can be raided. Like this place. Eight ducats. And then Venice and the Knights. I know I can raid the Knights. That was funny. I will raid them again. There is more ducats to be had. Ooh, 14 ducats off of this thing. Then the Gulf of... Oh, well, now a great power, apparently. Huh. Interesting. I have achieved greatness. And taken 32 ducats from the knights. Can I go take this random Genoese province and raid it as well? Yes. Five ducats. Okay. That was all for today that we could withdraw from the bank of European coasts. Uh, but we will gladly return. And take some more stuff. Why have the Ottomans not pieced out of this yet? I don't understand. And <laughs> the Knights counter raided Iskandaria, but I don't care because it's not mine. <laughs> you can raid that crap as much as you want. If it becomes mine, I'll care. But it's not become mine yet. Okay, Benet, you have no friends and you look mighty delicious. So allow me to prepare to consume you. And uh, then I will consume you. And it's going to be amazing. I wish I was at peace, though. I really want the Mamluks to go away. Do the Ottomans want Iskandaria? Is that why they're not peacing out? No, they don't care. They only care about this stuff right now. Whatever. Just peace out Anizar, whatever. Do it! Get us out of this war! I have a vassal to annex, and a war to declare. And two wars to declare. Hello, Dagbon. Um... Still no claims on this stuff. That's Gene. Oh, that's a claim I have. But my truce with you expires in four years. Oh, the Ottomans have peaced out. I have gained some prestige. Um, no ducats were taken. 
They end their overlordship wars. The Ottomans now owe me 40 favors. What? That's a lot of favors, Ottomans. How about I cash them in? Awesome. Which means now I can throw the Ottomans at someone. Can I throw them at Portugal? If I was to declare on Portugal, I can't tell yet. Not that I care so much about Portugal specifically, but I would like to take his colonial empire away from him. I would like to take all of his stupid islands and his Arguin and uh, my thing that he genocided the bastard and maybe that piece of Granada as well. I am very keen on that stuff. But I don't think the Ottomans can beat Castille, Aragon, and Portugal on their own. They are strong, but they have their limits. And they don't yet connect to me, so they'd have to use boats, and I don't trust the AI to use boats correctly. Let's just get our claim on Benay, and holy crap, Stronghai is destroying Dagbon. Yeah, Stronghai will need to die. He's eye to Janae and Katsina, but not to... Oh, hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. No. Bad rebels. Okay, it seems I have to pay for my army and go kill that. <sighs> Alright, let's go kill that. We've lost an admiral. I don't really care too much. Um, oh, this guy. I could probably fire him, but... Uh, who's Zealot? Am I converting anything? I'm not converting anything. This is too expensive to convert, especially Joma. What the hell? These are Malian separatists. They will need to be taught a lesson. Um, the Ottomans now trust me at uh, 85. Which is excellent. I am now at peace, so I will uh, recall the Ottoman one, because I'm pretty sure they're not going to betray me anymore. Um, and I will annex this guy. Oh, I'm paused because I encountered natives. Of course I encountered natives. I always encounter natives on this damn coast. And we will now annex this guy. Begin annexation of Mzab. We will regain a Diploslash, which will be helpful for vassalizing, say, Benay, for example. Who is now allied to Kenem Bornu. I have missed my chance to knock him down. Hey, Mossy! You're dying. Wait, you're not actually dying. Would you accept vassalization? You actually might. You actually might. And you have a lot of cores to gain back. You know what? It might be worth working on. Um, but right now... Hmm... I'm not sure. I want to try to it, to do it. Uh, Timbuktu and Conquest of Guirico, which is this thing. Which doesn't even belong to you anymore. So you're just stuck in a dead war. Okay, let's send this back. Are you at war with something now? No? Okay, we're almost ready. Tax income lost to make the emirs happy? Sure. Goodbye money. It's not like I need money, right? Okay. Now we are slowly but surely annexing Mzab, which will allow us to state a bunch of stuff and also gain a bunch of other worthless states. But such is life. I will fabricate a claim on Benet's capital of Benet. Which will be very useful for going to war with Benet. I will take my other army. Where's my other army? Oh, it's up here. Okay, cool. I will recall this guy. Songhai. Oh, crap. Songhai just ate all of that. Holy crap. I need to respect the Stronghai. Okay, you are independent. You have cores in uh, Jene. And probably in Stronghai. You have claims in Timbuktu, but it doesn't matter. But you would make a fine vassal. And you would not accept vassalization. Let me convince you otherwise. And when my army is back in position, I will attack Benet. How much war score is he worth? 95%. He would be... He is just the right size to become a vassal. Excellent. Let's recall the French guy. But it also means that if I do that, then I cannot uh, vassalize this guy. Well, I could. Truce with Janae has expired. I don't care too much about Janae right this second. 
Though I might if I get to ally this guy. Okay, Bene. You have one friend who does not matter. Let's fight. Where is even Canem Borni? Do I have a... I don't have a Conquistador. Can I get a Conquistador? Hey, nobles. Uh, give me a Conquistador. Give me a General. There we go. Lots of points. I am now over my Diplo limit, my military limit. That's a terrible general. You're fired. But 4232, that is an amazing conquistador. So you're going to go conquistadate Benin. And it's going to be glorious. He has rebels. I don't care about his rebels. Uh, oh, hey, there's his rebels. Hello, Benin rebels. Goodbye, Benet Rebels. Um, oh, too many diplomatic relations. Wait, what? How? How do you already have too many diplomatic relations? That doesn't even make sense. I don't even understand that, but okay. Alright. If you say so, I'm going to sit on your capital now. Can I walk all the way here? Can I... Um, I need another conquistador. How close am I to taking up? Um, actually not bad. If I look at institutions, if I look at colonialism, it is spreading into me from Portugal much faster than it was in, um, than uh, the other one was. Oh, hey, New World Colonization Rights, give that back. Grant New World Charters. Um, oh, I can even get points. I can get stuff for my merchants. Let's upset the merchants a lot in exchange for their services. Thank you very much, merchants. I need to take up in Diplo a lot. A lot, a lot. I also need to take up in Admin, but uh, that'll come very soon. We're almost done uh, economic ideas. Bene Siege is not going very well. Do you have a cannon? You don't even have a cannon. It would help if you had a cannon. Let's try to get a cannon. Let's build a cannon to help this poor army here. Um, okay, so Mosi is probably a lost cause in terms of Diplo vassalizing him. Oh, something changed. Maybe not anymore. There we go. Might be possible to Diplo vassalize him. Hooray! Alright, excellent. Very excellent. I am currently losing not that much money, actually, but it's going to get worse once my cannon is finished. Why is this siege not making me progress? Why do I keep rolling garbage like this? Oh, hello, Abomi. Uh, Dahomey, rather. Where'd you come from? It's like you just popped out into existence. And I'm pretty sure you have course somewhere. Not that you matter, but still. Um, yeah, I feel like I need another Conquistador. How am I in tech? I am still ahead of time in military tech. Despite all these penalties I powered through, I am ahead of time in military tech. Go figure. Also, go Morocco. Um, can I get admin points? Hey, Ulema, can I get admin points? Is it also time for admin points? It is not time for admin points. It will be. Oh, wait, this month. It will be, actually. Group Minister. On the 22nd. Excellent. There we go. Get admin points. We got our 150. We can finish economic ideas. This also unlocks a policy. I forgot about that. Oh, that's a terrible policy, but it's free, so might as well. It's terrible because I don't have any colonial nations. New World Missions, and I can even seek support of the clergy if I wanted. I'm not going to do that, though. You have a strong claim, so that's exciting. Um, hey, where'd my cannon go? You've interrupted the cannon! Damn it! Also, why are you losing, Jolof? Why are you losing to this guy? He is tech 6, you are tech 6. Stop losing. I can gain ducats and insult my merchants, but make my ulema happy. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Let's force them to pay. Who cares about the merchants? Certainly not I. I got a lot of money out of this deal. 
Also, finally, the Siege of Benet is making good progress. Which is truly an exciting turn of events. Uh, he probably was busy fighting rebels or something. Wait, no, that's Kenan Bornu. That is Benet. Oh, uh, goodbye, Vassal. Goodbye, Vassal. Can I go deal with Kenan Bornu? I don't care about him. I won't actually deal with him yet. But, well, we'll have to see what we do. Can I build buildings that are useful? Not very, but I will build a few, I guess. Yeah, I'll keep the rest of the money, because it's going to keep going down. We are not on an upward trend for money right now. Things are not looking up. When does my truce with you expire again? In 1514, uh, so in two years. Excellent. Excellent! And I still don't have a claim on this. Or on this. Mossi is still a potential vassal thing. I'm gonna proclaim his guarantee. So that no one touches him. And everyone knows not to touch him. And I'll extract everything I can. The Siege of Benet has fallen. Uh, knowledge is power, sure. Who cares about a little bit of... That's a lot of unrest. Okay, maybe I should have cared. Let's just bump up stability. That solves a few problems. Okay. Benet is unhappy with his situation. I wish to discover him. And then uh, vassalize him entirely. As long as nothing else declares on him, it's fine. <sighs> and then, well, I think we will have properly sealed off Guinea. Yeah, this is this is all Guinea. Uh, Sahel is up here. N Niger is this. I don't know how far Sahel goes. I think Sahel goes all the way up here. Out in, like, Funj or something. So we'll need to be mindful of that. What is this? Is someone else attacking you? No, that's Mossy. Why is Mossy over here? Is he trying to help me already and he doesn't even realize it? That's a good future vassal. Yeah, I'm gonna be, like, temporarily too over my Diplo limit. But it is for a good cause. Is my cannon still building? No, my cannon got cancelled. Excellent is not what I would say here, game. But if you insist... Let's get my cannon. Okay, and let's keep fully sieging Benin. Can I peace out? Oh, Cannon Bornu. Can I just white peace you? I would love to just white peace you. Go away. Pleasure doing business with you. All right. This makes my life so much easier. There's now no progress being made on this siege at all because Cannon Bornu is not in the war anymore. You have been abandoned by your friend, Benet. How do you feel about that? Also, where's my cannon? Where's my cannon? So how loyal are my vassals, actually? That's not so bad. That's not so bad. They should still be loyal after I eat Benet. Because Benet is weak. I think. I believe. And I hope. Your League of Venice disbanded. Congratulations. Uh, the home may have insulted me. That's not a smart move. Especially as I keep sieging this guy. Can I, can I vassalize you? Are you gonna accept now? Moroccan vassal? I got a coalition of Benning and two losers. Which is not a real coalition. And he accepts. So let's just do it. That's a lot of diplo points that just go by, but uh, it's worth it. See? All is well. And now the only one that's unhappy is the new vassal. The other two are fine. Alright. Let us... Uh, conquistador our way through our new possession. You, Mossi, will accept an alliance. As it should be. And... Uh, yeah, let us uh, hug this guy into obedience. When do you cap out? Oh, five more. You're almost capped out. Alright. Does Benny have claims anywhere? I assume he does. I'll explore them. Uh, I'm losing money right now, but that's fine. Benny is unfortunately the wrong religion. 
That's a problem that can eventually be fixed anyway. It's actually much easier for him to be dead than for him to be uh, Sunni right now, since I don't have the means to truly really convert. And I have apparently reached the end of the episode, so for now, I'll thank you guys for watching. And I will see you next time where we'll continue our exploration and conquest of West Africa as our truce with Timbuktu is about to end. See you guys next time.